beautifuls. I'm just Jackie is here. And listen, y'all already see the title. Y'all know what I'm about to do. Not really going to give y'all a face or anything. I just wanted to come up here real quick and, you know, let you guys know how I'm feeling about the new Fenty, um, what is it, Brow MVP? Yeah, so I've been trying this out for uh, probably hmm, maybe three, four weeks now, wh whatever, you know, and everything. But I figure why not come up here because I'm about to run out for the day, um, you know, go see some family and stuff. And, um, yeah, just do a simple ass face, so. And keep it moving, all right? So, listen, first things first, let me just tell you. <sighs> Packaging's cute. Okay, super cute. Now, y'all know I'm just Jackie. Do not like retractable, retractable, uh, mechanical, uh, brow pencils and stuff. But it's Fenty, and I wanted to try it. So, I was like, $20 can't be $20. I want to say it's like $19.90 something, whatever. It's $20, $20, whatever a little bit of tax or whatever. So, um, so retractable pencil, they got like 10, at least 10, at least 10 colors, y'all, 10 colors. The color I got is black brown. And that was like the closest to my, um, Anastasia, uh, Beverly Hills, you know, brow pencil and everything. Um, the main difference between, my brow pencil that I love and the Fenty, well, two main differences. First of all, it's okay. Let's let's stay here since I opened it. Retractable pencil, okay, all right. Mechanical. Um, not a fan of those because I feel like they break easy. Okay, and then two, it's not a spoolie. It's a brush. You brush these brows, bitches. You hear me? Okay, so. Spoolie brush. Okay. I know y'all probably wondering, like, uh, why do you have this in the video? Listen, because when I do these brows, I'm using both. Okay. So let me tell you about my experience with just using the brow MVP, right? All right. So, um, obviously, I did my brows with just the brow MVP MVP in the beginning. And they were nice and all. Don't get me wrong. The brows look nice. But my thing with it is my brows look too. I don't know the word I'm using. I don't know the word I'm looking for. My brows look too, not too manicured. They didn't, they look they they didn't look natural natural enough for me okay they didn't look natural enough for me and um and i just like the way the anastasia Beverly hair brows just make my brows look at at the end of the day okay so i was like damn i paid this money for this brow pencil i need to figure out what i'm doing with this brow pencil right so i was just sitting here doing my makeup one day and i was like let me try this. Okay, so Anastasia Beverly Hills, right? My main thing is I can I can control I can control the pressure um on this pencil. I can control on both okay, you can control control the pressure on both of these pencils, right? But here's the thing. I my fear is I can't put too much pressure on a mechanical pencil because I'm scared it's going to break, okay? And nine times out of ten, it, it, it usually breaks because I'm kind of heavy-handed, right? But with the Anastasia Beverly Hill, Hills, I don't have to worry about too much pressure and breaking. My thing is too much pressure in the front part of my brows having too much of the pencil and not looking natural enough. I mean, I, I still finish them off good, whatever, whatever. I get away with it, but I, it, it's certain days now you're gonna say days it's been certain times that where well, i know i went too heavy in the front you, you know what i'm saying you the natural brow look is you know it's is lighter here and it, you gradually it gets denser as you get to the tip all right so lo and behold i was like okay what am i doing this blah, 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 blah. all right this is what jackie decided she's gonna do with this pencil. So I'm just going to show y'all my new brow routine. I, I mean, it's the same it's the same brow routine I done had for the last probably couple of years or whatever. 
since I've been going hard with this Anastasia Beverly Hills pencil, but I, I never came back and did an updated brow routine because it's, it's short, simple, sweet. If you look, if you seen my other two brow videos, the first one, too much going on. The second one, I did condense it, but it's, I, I'm like, I found a pencil that I love. I ain't got to do so much work. Here we go. So if all that being said, let's just go and get into the meat potatoes because I done ran my mouth for five minutes already. Okay. So Anastasia Beverly Hills. First of all, I already done brushed the brows, right? So like I said, going hard. Yeah. With my Anastasia Beverly Hills. And you know nothing ever wants to go right when you're on camera. So if it don't go right while I'm on camera. Sorry. Go check out my IG. You see my handles. I know I don't post as much as I used to. I give y'all something at least once a week. So, y'all know IG was my baby. And with everything that's been going on, I've been transitioning through a lot of stuff. I just stopped. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Not, I, I, won't, I Yeah, I, I literally... You might as well just say I stopped because Lord knows y'all know Jackie used to post like six times a day. But I was giving y'all different content though. I was, that's when I was giving y'all fashion outfits that I would see online. And I think that's super cute. I would give y'all natural hair pictures of other beautiful girls and their natural hair. I was going hard. Then of course I would post a, post me, you know, whether it be my natural hair or outfit of the day. Or, my, or makeup, whatever. I was giving y'all everything at one point in time. So I want to say I kind of burnt myself out trying to keep up. And then the shit that was going on in my personal life, check out my Life After 40 series. And by the way, I want to update that series. Give y'all an update on Life After 40 for those who have been wondering about my Life After 40. Okay, so that's the end stage of Beverly Hills, right? So I'm definitely gonna give y'all an update. So then I come in with the the brow MVP, you know, at the ends. Draw that line. Cut is lighter. It's naturally lighter, even though the color is black brown. Is that what it's called? It's black brown, but you can't pit so much pit. You can't put so much pressure on these mechanical pencils because, like I said, um. The damn tips break, and you ain't gonna get your money's worth. And that's another reason why I don't buy mechanical pencils, because I feel like you don't get your money's worth. There's not as much product with mechanical pencils as there is with the regular pencils that you just sharpen, you know, or what have you. All right, y'all, I'm getting up in here. So, but you see how it's lighter, darker, you know. So I figured that's that's the way I figured out I'm going to use my my brow MVP because then I can get a more natural brow look. Cause like I said, when I was doing the whole brow with the MVP, I didn't care for it too much. That's just me. Y'all know these brows ain't gonna be perfect. But Jackie tries to get them as close to perfection as I can. All right, so, but yeah, um, but that's it. Beautiful, look, that's it. Beautiful, as you know, this is good as it's gonna get today. Yeah, cause y'all, can you see it? It's lighter than it gradually gets darker. Okay, gradually gets darker. That's that's my main thing, and you know, keep it in, give it a more natural look. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna finish off these brows. I'm telling y'all, keep it super simple now, y'all. Super simple. And I just finish it off. Today I'm just gonna use a color that's close to my skin. Close, but not is that because I'm not doing no full face today. And um so I don't really want that my brow highlighted like that. Right? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that was LA Girl Pro Concealer. I don't know the color. And y'all know. I don't have my magnifying glass, and it's a struggle bus to see these colors, right? Okay, as long as y'all, I mean not the colors, to see those names of the color. But yeah, just find a color that's close to your skin. 
and you finish your brows off. Not all the time, but this is just a day I don't, I'm not doing a full, full face of nothing. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you even them out. Yeah, I know I feel like my brows move when I'm doing my brows. <laughs> so, yeah. And then you just do the same thing on the other side. So, basically, beautiful. So, giving you guys a brow update. How I do my brows. Which you pretty much already know if you've been watching my most recent um, makeup videos. Um, and i let y'all know my thoughts about the Fenty Brow MVP. It's nice. But is it something that I honestly? I guess the question for I'm just Jackie is: Would I buy this again when I run out? No, <laughs> no, I wouldn't because I'm gonna. I told you brows don't never go right when you ask on camera. Let me just finish. Oh, hold on. Let me finish with the with the um. Like they go right when you on when you on camera and it's not the focus. Does that make does that make sense? This damn video about brows, and now they now I can't get my life right with the brows because it knows I'm recording. You know what I'm saying? So let me come back, and I just do short either upward strokes or downward strokes depends on how I'm holding the pencil, whatever, whatever. Yeah, a little short, upward, downward, whatever strokes. And my brows never look the same, y'all. You know what I'm saying? They never look the same day in, day out. They always gonna be different. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you got that tail on your arm, on your brows. All right. And then um, I just go like this with my finger to pat it in, like so. But yeah, I wouldn't buy this. I wouldn't buy this um pencil again at all, y'all. And then y'all know I like to finish my brows with not finish my brows, but set the powder. Set the powder. Y'all, I can't even talk today. Set the concealer. If I can find a brush, I can't find a brush I normally use, so I'm just gonna use one. But I like to set my concealer with my um Estee Lauder double wear. You know, just set it before I do any eyeshadow. But I'm not doing any eyeshadow today. Keep giving y'all just a little nice, simple, natural look. Right? And that's it. That's it. I finished my brows and I'm about to get out. I'm about to get off this video because all I'm gonna do is put some um some MSF on my face. Oh, and I'm gonna go ahead on and use my Lorac. Keep it real simple black eyeliner keep it moving okay that that's it for the day for i'm just jackie but no i would not buy this brown mvp again because i'm not i'm just not a fan of mechanical pencils okay if she made it like this i, I probably would you know but nah i wouldn't buy this again but i am gonna get my i'm gonna get my money's worth out of it and do what i just did today y'all let me know what, what y'all think y'all understand what i'm saying where you want to get that more natural brow look when it's supposed to be a little lighter here in the front and then it gradually gets darker right right yeah natural right looks really really natural okay so yeah um I know I was all over the place with this alleged review, alleged brow update or whatever, but y'all get the gist. Y'all know I'm just Jackie. Just be random. I just randomly decided to come up here and just do this video. But it's a, it's a, it's a nice product. The the price point is cool if you like a mechanical pencil or whatever. whatever. Price point is cool. Packaging is cool. For me, I'm just Jackie. I love my regular regular schmegular pencil and until somebody can beat this baby she's always going to be number one right now okay all right beautifuls until the next video i catch y'all later deuces